This is Tim Adams reporting for Rochester Indie Media. We just finished up the Community Education Task Force meeting. We're going to do a few interviews here with some folks. The mayor should concentrate on, on the job as being mayor of the city. And as far as I'm taking over the schools, I think that should be left to all the um, officials we elected. I impose mayor control because he doesn't know what he's doing. And if he did, um, there would be no crime. Everybody would have a job. Everybody would, the households wouldn't be, wouldn't be looking for money. Um, basically, he said at the last meeting I was at that kids should have a job. They should go to school, do this, that, and the other, and have a job. There are some households where the parents don't have jobs, but he wants to give the kids a job. And that doesn't make sense to me. He doesn't have a plan. He doesn't know what he's doing. And I don't think he should do it. I, I think he's biting up a little bit more than he can chew. Well, I'm against mayoral control because I think the whole move the mayor trying to take over the city school board is about really uh, carrying out like economic programs of, of forced austerity measures on Rochester citizens. So what exists now is a school system that's been consistently underfunded for years and years with mayoral control can much, much more easily be you know, uh, further, further have the screws driven into it, further be torn apart and then replaced with privatized school systems and charter schools, which is not a school system that's based on really educating students are making critical thinking citizens out of people, but uh, a system based on profit where you have a parasitic layer that's going to be sucking uh, money out of all of our young children's lives. So. And uh, we've been working for years to improve the Rochester City Schools, and we're focused on all kinds of things that really work, small class sizes, uh, cultural competency training, racial justice training for teachers, um, uh, and, and smaller schools. These things really work, too, and, and we're right now here in the Freedom School. This school works, and we know getting parents involved works. Those things work. Uh, mayoral control doesn't. Why are we talking about something that doesn't work? But the fundamental issue is uh, subjects, people's right to vote, our right in accordance with the uh, uh, New York State Constitution to choose uh, seven, rep seven local representatives on the Rochester Board of Education. And we already don't have, parents don't, and community members don't have adequate access under this current system. And now we're talking about uh, reducing the number of representatives to uh, 10 as opposed to 17, which would give, which would put an even greater distance between parents and, and uh, the people they vote for to represent them, not just parents, but citizens in, in general. And so suffrage is the fundamental issue in, in this.